just finishing up with school for the day. <laughs> we talked about the human body a few years ago when we first started homeschooling. Uh, <laughs> and we kind of came back around. We're, so we're doing anatomy and physiology. And uh, so they're putting together skeletons today. Where's that go in your body? Yeah. yeah, right there. That's like the same size as you almost. Here. Rosie's gotten hers done. <laughs> so it's not uncommon for this room to be a total disaster by the time school is done. But that's okay. Yeah, we clean it later <laughs> after school. Look at these. Whoop. So we're putting together our skeletons. The leg is as big as from a Where's that go in your body? Like here. <laughs> kind of. Those are your hip bones. Yeah, there you go. Up these a little bit. These legs are as big as where this ends to the top of the head. They're long legs. Yep. <laughs> What's what's something interesting you guys learned in our lessons today? The bones are not solid all the way through. They can break even though they have. What about our other lessons? What did you learn today, Ireland? Oh, what's that tissue called? I don't know. Do you remember? You can Does somebody else remember what it's called? Muscle. You cannot. Muscle? No. Muscle? What makes up your ears and your nose? Cartilage. Cartilage. There's cartilage that helps cushion your bones. That's you, a shark you can pull out your bones because of your teeth. Yep, your bones are teeth. Mm. Don't pull out your bones. Gross. A shark is completely made out of cartilage. Except, no except for his teeth, right? Yeah, or and the ones that it eats. What's something interesting you thought about today? You don't know. What did you like today, Lorelai? What lessons did we even have today? Telescope's body, Can you help me? music, Alpha, telescope's Can body, you fairy tales, help me? and that's Alpha, the day about making friends. Yeah. They, what did you think of our fairy tale story, Lorelai? That, it was funny. The board kept coming back and singing some songs, but the board flew away because yeah. he saw Oh, so which bird was better to have? The real one. The real one, right? Because it, it can one. feel things. Yeah. What did you learn today, Naomi? Oh, sorry, Ireland. Two birds what? No, two adults were in the ball pit, but they both have thick teeth. Oh. What did you like today, Naomi? Don't know? Rosie wants to share what she's been making. We've been crocheting together. She's doing a really good job. There's some spots that ended up a little bit wonky, but that's okay because that's part of learning. And here's the one I've been making. It's wonky. 
Wonder. Mine's a little bit wonky too. <laughs> but so is life, right? Blankets are kind of a a symbol of our lives and how there's all these different things that make up parts of our lives and they're not always perfect and some parts can be ugly or frustrating but our life is beautiful at the end and there's a plan right yeah we played hide and seek last night yeah that was fun who had the best hiding place she did are you sure no i overheated twice like it so Rosie hid in one of Roy's coats and just sat on the chair and did not get found for like 10 minutes. It was so good. He has a hiding, hiding place that you can never get on the fridge. And I hid on there. You hid on top of the fridge. And then um, I crocheted for a while and hid Rosie under the blanket too while I was crocheting. <laughs> It took a while for her to be found. So. Philip, Philip hid in the coat closet and put uh, snow pants over his legs, so he didn't. <laughs> so he didn't get found right away. Yep.